Thanks. We're getting answers on the latest developments in Palmer as plans for a new retail development are now in the works. This as residents continue to push to add a new train stop in their town, part of the highly anticipated East-West Rail. Western Mass News reporter Kristen Brunell has the story. Ann Miller and Ben Hood of Palmer are part of the group Citizens for a Palmer Rail Stop, where they advocate for a new Palmer Rail Station to be part of the proposed East-West Trail. We've been pushing since about 2015 to um, bring passenger rail back to Palmer. The rail would connect Pittsfield to Boston via a high-speed train, with potential stops along the way in Chester, Springfield, Palmer, Worcester, and Boston. People who live here a long time, and we're, we're, we've been here 20 years, but they remember going on the train to New York, to Springfield, of course, to Boston. And when you restore that, there's a lot of people who will do that. Governor Maura Healy has proposed $4 million to prioritize a Palmer Station rail project as part of her 2024 fiscal year budget. Those budget negotiations are still ongoing at the State House. However, Hood tells us if this new project goes through in Palmer, it will benefit the town and the region. It would be a, a big economic driver and it would uh, to the region and it would also create a tourism you know, industry, I think, in this area and restore a lot of our downtowns that in the rural areas of Massachusetts still have people in them but have not done so well lately. Their push comes as a new mixed retail development is in the works at 1186 to 1190 Thorndike Street. The developer of the property, Outrig USA, confirmed to Western Mass News. They say in a statement in part, quote, development plans are in the early stages, but their website provided a detailed map of their proposal you can see here. Developers tell us they are very excited to come to this site here in Palmer, right alongside Route 32 in town and open new businesses like Starbucks, Chipotle and Jersey Mike's. And Hood adds new businesses will help with his fight to bring a rail stop back to Palmer. The new master plan um, foresaw that they would work on uh, bringing in more business opportunities. And so, of course, if you put the train in downtown, that's going to definitely create even more of, an, you know, of, a, of a climate for good business development in the town. Reporting in Palmer, Kristen Brunell, Western Mass News.